morning everyone today is the 28th of December and it is Wednesday and Ali and I are planning to have a really productive day today we are what tissue he needs tissue hold on <laughs> he's having a nightmare with his car basically I just hate Ali's car um, obviously I don't mean hate but it's just it's dying on us and he's having a nightmare with it, so we only really drive my car. Plus, Ali is the worst driver in the world ever. You good, babe? <laughs> yeah, so if you only ever see us driving my car, it's because I don't really like Ali's car. I don't feel like it's reliable. Um, so when we move, Ali will be getting a new car because... Um, it's about time he deserves one <laughs> obviously we've relaxed over the christmas period and really indulged and enjoyed ourselves and just let our hair down and it's been amazing i can't remember a time where we've actually done this before so it's been much needed but what it does is it kind of like instills motivation in us again and we're just raring to go so this morning we're going to the gym obviously we're starting a new routine in the new year with Ali working from home so we've decided that we're going to be going to the gym together in the morning and that's what we're doing today so we're heading to the gym we're going to get in a workout and then we're going to have breakfast then we're going to come home and have a massive sort out of the house and just get really sort of organized and ready for the new year. Lulu, you're not cut, no. No. Oh, that stinks of egg. Yeah, it's because you just made eggs. <laughs> Get really organized so that we're hitting 2017 like on a high and we're just ready to go. Aren't we, babe? On a high, after that pre-workout, I should hope so. <laughs> <laughs> right so I guess let's get going and it's also it's such a lovely day today it's sunny and frosty and it's my favorite kind of morning so yeah we're gonna go pick up my car first and then we're gonna head to the gym so let's get cracking it's been many years since we hung out party every weekend out and about then we had no cares we had no <laughs> doubt <laughs> staying up all night and playing music <laughs> loud I look it's back, these the were the days We were she in a happy, so happy much. place In all the years since we hung out You took off and left this town <laughs> Suddenly you're here And eternity since we were together I believe you're here And I'm falling in love again Oh my god, it's so frosty We've just both popped our cars in to be cleaned Because mine is an absolute state And um I don't really know why you're cleaning yours because yours is a pile of crap. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> need a new car. He does need a new car. I've already told them about your car. <laughs> so now we're going to go and warm up and go to the gym and then have some food because I'm so hungry. Baby, you're the same girl as you used to be. But the way your eyes shine bright in me. You're the very same girl. Look at that smile. Oh, I haven't seen you go in a while. Got the fortune in the thing. Everyone around. So I'm just back from a really good gym session and we ate, I had a jacket potato with tuna for lunch which was amazing, obviously still obsessed with those jacket potatoes. Um, I also went and picked up my post which I haven't done for a few weeks and there's parcels from Christian Dior and Guerlain and also the Hut groups, so that's three of my favourites. So I think what I'm going to do is go inside and open them up with you because um, I think there's going to be some lovely little bits in there. So we have Christian Dior, Galan, and also this one, which kind of looks like it's from the Biscuiteers. I really hope it's a Biscuiteers biscuit because, oh, my favorite. <gasps> Got my name on it. Right, I just picked up the suit from the dry cleaners. Oh, good. Oh, where, oh, it's from the Dior Holiday Couture Collection. Eyes and brows, very nice. <laughs> you sit, 
Ali playing with Lumi. <laughs> Let's open this. Ah, Oh, it was for Christmas. How lovely. Then we have Galan. Ugh. Babe, I was in the car. Yeah. And I was like, I can really smell tuna. Like, I know that I just had tuna, but I can really smell it. Yeah. And I'd obviously got a bit of tuna down my jacket and it had fallen out onto the seat. Oh. And obviously the heated seat was on. <laughs> so it's making my car stink of tuna. I found it. I found it, don't worry. Don't worry. Oh wow. So we have Guerlain shower gel and body lotion, which um, if you followed me for a while, you'll know that I like posh shower gel. It just makes me feel like I'm getting a hug in the morning and just feels very luxurious. So um, it's a little bit of indulgence. So I'll definitely be giving these a go. I also have this. <gasps> it's got my name engraved on it. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. I love these lipsticks as well. Look at this, when you pull it out, it's got a mirror. Are you all right there? Oh, and it's nude as well, so it's like my perfect color. You and your puffer jacket. He's taking his puffer jacket on right by the, the speaker of my camera. Men. So anyway, that's the girl and lipstick and it's got my name engraved on it, which you can see. There we go. So that's that. And then we've got a card as well. We've had post. I went and picked up my post. Uh -huh. so what's this? Oh, that's so pretty. Personalised gift. See you soon. Aww. Love Christmas cards, even though Christmas is over. I actually don't care. It's still lovely. One, which is from, I think, look fantastic. Ooh, this looks like the look fantastic beauty box, which I have never had a beauty box before. And this is the only one I've ever had. And I absolutely love it. I got the Christmas one as well. So this is the limited edition one. And it looks like it's got quite a few of my favorite brands in it. I'm not gonna lie. You can see Kerastase. It comes wrapped like this. You see? So it's got HD Beauty, High Definition Beauty, which I use their brow pencil all the time. This is an eyebrow palette. So eye and brow palette. So I'll be giving that one a try because I love their brow pencil. It's also got the Illamasqua Beyond Powder. I haven't used a lot of Illamasqua products and I feel like I need to get more of these in my life. I love how you can like just try new products with these boxes and um, you just don't really know what you're getting until you get the box. So it's like, I would never have picked this up, but now that I've got it, I really want to try it. Then we have the Elixir Ultima. And this is like a travel size, which I use, if it focuses, I use this all the time. This is one of my favorite serums and now I've got it in a travel size. So I can um, take this with me when I travel, which is brilliant. There's also Declior, which I love. My first ever good facial was using Declior, so that was amazing. Ren, which is another one that I really like. Nighttime facial. I love these things that you put on your face overnight and you wake up and your skin looks amazing. So I'll be trying that one. And then also Grow Gorgeous Split Ends Leave-In Serum. So that's that, and then on to the last one. Please say it's a biscuit, please say it's a biscuit. I was craving biscuits so badly last night. I love how you poke your head around the corner when I say biscuit. <laughs> the best kind of treats come in these boxes, that is for sure. Stop eyeing up my biscuit. It's not biscuits, it is Biscuiteers chocolate. Oh, they're engagement chocolates. Aww. Oh, this is so cute. Look, they sent us engagement chocolates. I didn't even know they did chocolate. And we have the cake one. Oh no, wait, that's dark chocolate. I'm gonna have this one. Yeah, I'll have the opposite. Keep it this one. Okay, first time at trying Biscuiteers chocolate. Cheers. Mmm. 
It's got praline in it. I'm gonna put these in the fridge and have them later on. And now tidy all of this mess up. No. <laughs> no. No. Ali! You're such a dick. No. Baby, you the same as you used to be. But the way your eyes shine bright in me. You're the very same girl. Look at that smile. Though I haven't seen you go a while. Like, got the fortune in the thing. Everyone around you knows your name. Always gonna be. Always gonna be. The same old girl to me. I've just ordered 50 bottles of mini Prosecco for for New Year's for and four of you. for four of us well I'd rather have too much than too little but yeah so we've just been working this evening and now I'm gonna make some dinner for us so we're gonna have uh, like corn chicken strip things and salad which I love. Ali's not had it before, but I'm making it for him anyway. And then we're gonna watch a movie. I don't know which movie we're gonna watch, but we're gonna watch one and snuggle on the sofa. And then tomorrow I am meeting Ali's auntie and I think her new boyfriend that I've met briefly once. Yeah. yeah. And his daughter, because I think his daughter wants to, um, wants to get into the world of like blogging and YouTube. So I thought I'd uh, have a little chat with her about that so I'm going to do that tomorrow and then I'm going to go see my grandma and then in two weeks time Lydia's going to have fibre optic broadband which means that there's no more two hour upload oh my god yeah so I have suffered with 0 0.7 meg broadband for three years three years I've been spending about 100 pounds a month on data uploading videos downloading things like pictures and videos and stuff like that and um I was under the impression that we couldn't have fibre optic where we are, so we just never spoke to them about it. You'd think they would have offered it to us when we continuously phoned up saying we've got no internet. You'd think they would have said, why do I think have... it's a very new thing for here because when we moved in, the couple said that we couldn't get it. They were like, oh, you can't, the, cl the fastest you can get here is two meg. And so we were just like, oh, okay. But at the time it wasn't really a big deal because we didn't do YouTube. Well, anyway, we've got now that Ali's uh, working from home. Miraculously, we have fibre optic because he decided to phone up and ask for it. No, so, I've got why couldn't you have just done that for me? Yeah, it didn't affect him. <laughs> anyway, let's make some dinner now so that we can finish up. And oh my god, I look like shit. I don't want to say anything, but <laughs> right, let's make some dinner. actually today that this video should go out I think um, it's another sunny frosty day it's so beautiful it's even frostier than yesterday and I just love it, it always puts me in a good mood um, I'm feeling a little bit achy after yesterday I'm not gonna lie um, my legs are like oh so I know that it's gonna get worse throughout the day we are just running late as usual to head to the Wavenden Arms because we are meeting Ali's Ali's auntie and her boyfriend and his daughter I believe and I'm just gonna chat through with her about what it is that I do and um, stuff like that. It's a bit of a busy day today so um, I'm gonna try and be as quick as possible but um, yeah we need to go pick up some pictures from our engagement to put around the house and then I'm going to see my favourite woman in the whole world, I'm going to see my grandma tonight and my cousin is gonna be there as well, um, I think with her boyfriend. As well. But yeah, so I'm just going to show you my outfit really quickly because um, we actually have to go because we're supposed to be there now. As usual, of course, we're always running late. <laughs> my outfit for the day is this jumper. It's kind of like a nude 
a nudie pink uh, jumper from Club Monaco. It's actually really long, but I hike it up using my Gucci belt and I think that um, it looks nice long or short actually, but with this outfit, I kind of like to, to hoik it up a little bit. I don't know if hoiking is a word, but I'm gonna use it anyway. <laughs> and then I've got this gilet from Me and M, which was, I think, a Christmas present from them actually. And it's super snuggly and reversible as well. Obviously I've got my Gucci belt on and my Stuart Weitzman boots and also the Gucci bag from my unboxing video that you would have seen during Vlogmas, which I love. Literally just obsessed with this bag and it goes with this outfit really nicely. But yeah, that is my outfit for the day. So let's get going before we make them wait around any longer. It's so bad that we're always late. I swear in every vlog I'm like, I'm late. Yeah, so anyway, I will um, speak to you in a bit. Right, this is my opinion. So when you first... Pressure, pressure. So I've just got oh, home. I'm so jealous. Ali is um, going shopping. Well, not shopping. He's going to pick up our engagement photos and I can't go because I have to do some work on the computer now. So I think we're going to go tomorrow instead. Yeah, it was really nice having lunch with them actually. And I spoke a lot about the wedding with Nessa. I didn't realise Nessa did events, so she actually did her daughter's wedding as well. So it'd be quite good to pick her brain and maybe have some help because I don't really have anyone to help me do this. And I work so much that it's kind of a scary prospect to just do it all by myself. So it might be quite nice for me to actually have some help, but I don't know. I don't know, there seems to be a bit of a divide between people that think that you should do it all yourself and people that welcome the help. I think possibly I'm one of those people that would just maybe like a helping hand. I don't think you have to let someone plan your entire day. That seems to, it's so funny the way that people think. They're like, you either plan your day yourself or you have nothing to do with it. They don't seem to understand that you can have help and still plan your day and have it all very much personalized. Just have someone making the phone calls and making things happen so that you don't have to. But we actually want to have an engagement party first, just so that like everyone can come together and, and have a sort of good time beforehand. So yeah, I think we're gonna have, have an engagement party. But yeah, now I'm gonna sit down and do a little bit of work and then get ready and head to my grandma's, which I'm so excited about. I always feel a bit weird filming at my grandma's house because I feel like it's a bit unfair to just stick a camera in her face. Um, but I know that so many of you want to know more about her. She's literally like the most fabulous woman I know. She's so funny and I love her stories. I love her house because I used to live with her before I moved in with Ali. So she's literally like just such, she's just like my favorite person. So um, it's gonna be nice to go and have lunch with her. My cousin's gonna be there as well. My cousin, we treat each other like sisters. Like, I just wind her up all the time. So it should be a really lovely day end to the day anyway but yeah I should probably get some work done it's now just gone 6 p.m and i feel like we've reached the stage in this relationship where i don't need to tell you that i'm running late you just know that i'm running late <laughs> we are running late to go to my grandma's um we're going there for dinner just to see like her and my grandma has a boyfriend which is nice um and my cousin and her boyfriend as well we're just going around there for dinner it should take us about an hour to get there, so we're just gonna be a few minutes late, but it's gonna be worth it. I love going around to see my grandma. Also, a couple of you asked about my necklace in my Christmas vlog. I only wear this on special occasions. Um, basically, this was a gift. It used to be a bracelet, and it was a gift to my grandma from my grandpa, and um, when he died, my grandma had the bracelet broken up, and me, my sister-in-law, my stepmom, my cousin all got pieces of the bracelet as like a little memory of my grandpa. Um, so I only wear it on special occasions or when I go and see my grandma. So yeah, we're going around there now and um, we're all set to go. We're just waiting for Ali because Ali takes longer than me to get ready. 
arrived at my grandma's we managed to survive Ali's driving um, Don't know how. although I moaned the whole way here like you're such a bad driver <laughs> but I'm so ready for some good food now so let's go inside quickly to get it once you're in you're stuck <laughs> Me and go in. Well, uh, oh, oh, what are you having Laurie I'm having wine you're having wine I might wait until after I've eaten <laughs> My cousin doesn't watch my channel, but she's happy to use me in her uni work, and this is the first time I'm seeing... Is that him? Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Where is he? You have boots! <laughs> I, I do, yeah. yeah. I did, yeah. You got that. How did she yeah. that? No, so that's not going on there, for that. but this is... Um, so yeah, she, way, don't you worry. Help she doesn't watch my sugar. videos, but she's happy to use my pictures <laughs> to get. Oh, this is really nice, though. Oh, that's really nice. It carries on. And seeing as I'm like obsessed with nude, that's really nice. That highlighter, by the way. I'm sorry, baby. It won't go on the inside, promise. So that's me. There's more you. Oh. Did you like it? Was it good? Very good. But I haven't. Are they truffles? Yep. <gasps> wow. So I'm going to leave this vlog here because I'm going to go and spend some time with my favourite person and just sit and have multiple cups of tea in the living room. She's already talking to Ali. When, the, when we got out of the car, Ali was like, I wonder what we're going to learn today <laughs> because he always learns something new from my grandma. Um, but I think my next video will be on New Year's Day. So hopefully you all have a lovely New Year's Eve. I'm going to be spending it with friends in my pyjamas. I think they might make me dress up for dinner, but... I'm gonna spend most of it in my pajamas. Um, but yeah, so I will speak to you soon. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already, because we hit 300K. Never gonna dance on camera again. <laughs>